understand that because we bought an animal three or five years ago and we paid six thousand dollars for that animal you know we have in our minds that this animal is worth a dollar figure and we need to understand that yes that animal was worth that dollar figure when we purchased it but now the market's come so far it's developed so much it's improved so much it's no longer highly competitive in the marketplace so the value of that animal goes down If you can speak about your alpacas with confidence, if you can show concern and empathy for other people and, and understand what they're looking for to improve their business, if you can communicate and if you can be courteous, you one other key thing. Without passion, striving to make money is futile if you haven't got a passion behind it. So I believe people that are in alpacas do it because they are passionate about it and they love the industry. Process and it's developed by Neil Rackham and it's called spin selling, a matter of having a conversation with a person. So I'm having a conversation with a person, the person's telling me all about their start, all about how things are going for them, they keep you know, producing these animals that aren't really the quality the style that I know could really help. But rather than just say, oh well I can solve your problem, I've got this stud mail, he'll bring the results that you're after. I then point out to them, paraphrasing back to them, so what you're actually saying is that you know, you're having problems, you're not getting consistency in your breeding, you'd like to By know this stage what they're saying, yeah, yeah. And they're sort of, you're building a rapport because they're understanding that you're listening to them and you're actually acknowledging what they're saying. Then go on to the implications. So you say, okay, so when you say that, like what, what would that mean to your point business? In the process where they're thinking, yeah, I really do need to look at finding outside services that will improve my health. So much information that people are taking. In this day and age, most of you probably have a website or some sort of internet activity. It's really simple to set up some sort of newsletter that is just a month. You wouldn't believe this month we've had this career. It puts you front of mind so that when that person then is considering buying an animal or they're looking for a stud service or whatever they need, you're at front of mind. You're the first alpaca breeder that pops into their Make mind. Make decisions to, so to spend money based on logic and emotion. So if you can find a need and add an emotion, which isn't very hard when you're trying to sell an alpaca. Thank you for listening. I'm Francine from Maven Training Institute. I'll be here all weekend. Thank you for persevering through our technical difficulties.